M0 FXB, welcome back to my crazy shack. We've got the Radtail RT20 here. And I noticed that when we look on the Radtail site, I will show you just here at the bottom, there's firmware. And so I'm going to risk it. So we've already downloaded it. I'm going to click it on my downloads. And it's this one here called Upgrade. Okay, above it was the software. So I'm literally just going to dive in and try and do it. The cable's already connected on the front there. So we'll run the program, which is, we're double clicking. The new, that's the new CPS, but we don't want that. We want the update XE. So let's do the bottom one first. That's the flash download XE. Oh, this is the font, so I think I'll do that one last. So we'll do this, it looks more like firmware here. Connect PC, we've done that. Select COM, connect the power supply to the radio, we've already done that. And click update, so let's just do it. COM, we know it's A, and then go update. And let's just see what it does. I haven't turned the power off, and there might be, it doesn't mention firmware mode, does it? Then keep the car radio in the off state and click the update. Ah, okay. So connect the power to the radio, keep the radio in the off state. So let's just close that down. Right, so what we're gonna do is turn it off, but leave the power connected like it said. So it's off. Um, and then back to the software, double click. You've got to take risks in this world, haven't you learned that? Then go eight. Then click update. Oh my God, something is actually happening. So there's a second bit of firmware as well uh, that says we can load prompts and things. And, I'm gonna, and you've got to load them one at a time. So this is crazy. So I'm not going to actually turn the radio back on yet because I remember reading. Oh, what am I doing messing around with that? <laughs> I remember reading. Don't mess with it. So we'll leave that off. It looks like that's finished, yeah? Okay, we'll close that. And then we're going to open the second window, which is the bottom one here. And it says, do these one at a time. So we'll go COM, 8, and then we're going to do that. Done. Font. Uh, is that one doing anything? Oh, it is. We're living dangerous here, guys and girls. Um, it's a bit glary in here, isn't it? Sorry about the lighting, but hey, Steven Spielberg had to learn. Please hit the like, subscribe, buy my wife a coffee. I keep telling you how beautiful she is, how lucky I am. And all these kids that I've had with my wife, have a look. Loads of kids, six kids, two grandkids. I'm the luckiest guy on the planet. Uh, and I get to play radio all day. And how do I do that? One day I might tell you, there is a secret. Um, but anyway, at the moment, just let this load. Remember, health is everything. I know there's, we've all got problems and we all worry about this and the other, but when we have to look after our bodies and our health more than everything else, because if we're healthy, then we can look after our family and our friends. Don't eat too many sweets, chocolates, McDonald's, Coke, all that stuff is going to kill you early and it's going to be a painful death as well and months and months in hospital. Try to eat better and keep active. Don't just lie in bed, don't just sit around. Keep active every day, you'll live longer. Um, right, voice prompts now. So this is, um, it's gonna be good, le good learning for pe other people that have got this set. Uh, so the voice prompts have all gone in and we're trying not to mess with it. So thanks so much for watching my channel. Welcome all the new people, all newbies. Welcome back 
older people that have gone away from the hobby because they had too many people, too many radio police. Welcome them back, invite them. Say to everyone you know that's interested in radio, come back to the hobby, it's a great, a great time. See you on Hubnet. Hubnet's really good. Talk Group 91, yeah, can be a bit annoying at times, but overall, DMR, Talk Group 99, it's, I think it's fantastic. And then everyone's friendly on D-Star, Reflector 30, Reflector 1 Charlie. Try it all out, ignore the people that misbehave. You get that anywhere you go in the world. You go to Tesco's, you go to the supermarket, people misbehave, that's just normal. Right, we've downloaded everything. Let's get this radio nice and big. And let's hope we haven't broken the radio that I've only had um, for a short while. Um, so let's just hold it down. And nothing's happening at the moment. <laughs> Okay, don't worry, because if it don't work, I'm going to add <laughs> new firmware. Let's try, let's just finish the instructions. So, according to the instructions, it says, don't, don't try and turn it on. Let's just make sure it's, it's on. I'm not actually sure if it's on. It's saying, add right to the radio with the new CPS. Yeah, it says it right here, but I better... You know, just add, you need to perform this at your own risk if it goes wrong. After writing is complete, do not perform any operations on the RTM20. Open the RT new CPS XC, um, add your frequencies and then write to the radio before disconnecting and reconnecting the power supply. I haven't disconnected the power supply, I have turned it off, but I haven't. So what we're going to do is go to that XC and we are living dangerously. So new CPS. Yes, so this is the new CPS, which we have never used, and this is what's going to save our radio, we hope. If not, I will, I'll, I'll work out a way to bring it back, don't you worry. So, um, image, we don't need that, power on, config, key, channels. Let's just get Hubnet in there, 434, I'll just do one channel for now. CTCSS 77, tone. Actually, that's, I bet you that one is the receive one. We want none. We want the transmit one, which is here. Uh, keep the power low. Uh, what narrow name? We got the name, haven't we? No, alias is the name. Hubnet. Okay. Uh, and then we go port, which is eight, yes. And then we go right. Oh, uh, we might have to do the whole process again. Let me fiddle and I'll work it out.